Hi, I just wanted to give you a rundown on end times prophecies and to tell you why we know we are in the last days. Israel became a nation in 1948. The war in Israel that started last year um, is necessary for the end times because Israel must be in a war to have a peace deal. The entire world is turning against Israel. There is an increase in persecution of Christians. There is apostasy of the churches. There are wars and rumors of wars. Riots and protests and unrest. Senseless violence. The spread of the gospel being spread everywhere. During the tribulation period, 144,000 will preach it everywhere. If you're not a Christian, you should become one right now, before it's too late. Increase in immorality and sexual perversion. Failing economies. Increase in natural disasters. Pestilence and plagues. Strange things in the skies. Mockers and scoffers. Increase in deception and lies. Increase in knowledge, technical or increase in knowledge of the word of God. Either way, the increase of to and fro. We know more about the, the last days than we did before. So either way, the, that prophecy is true. Lawlessness in the last days. Lawlessness starts at the top all the way down. The love of many is growing cold, good called evil and evil called good. Increase in false prophets. Technology for the mark of the beast, insert chips and t into you. That's in the King James Version. It's into this, the hand or head, not on. One world monetary system. Build the third temple in Israel. Talk of it means we're close to the last days. They need the red heifers. That the, the, the red heifers they now have for the first time in 2,000 years. The temple likely happens after the rapture. Artificial intelligence is now available. Lies and deception may be part of the beast system and demonic control. Rise of Satanism and evil. It's openly satanic. All these things are ramping up in intensity. We are in the last days. It's all happening together now for the first time. All these things, a lot of them have happened before. None of them could have. So we know we are in the last days. The Bible is real. Jesus is real. Heaven and hell are real. It's time to pay attention to it. It's time to get saved by the blood of Jesus Christ and do his will.